Hey there, what's up? This is Seth. And I came across kind of an obscure problem today that I come across pretty rarely, but it has happened a number of times over the years that I've been trying to get delinquent tax lists and sort them. And the problem is um, when I get the list from the county, what they'll do is they'll send it to me in this format that's called comma delimited format which is not really the format that I want. What they'll do is they'll send me this text file, or you know, like a TXT file, which is what you're looking at right now, with just, you know, tons and tons and tons of information, and it's really just separated by commas, and that's really all I have to work with. So instead of like having these broken out into individual cells that I can then separate and delete and all of that, it's, none of that is done for me. It's just this massive block of text that's basically impossible to work with in this current format. But the good news is it's actually very quick and simple to get this into the exact format that we want. And it's really not hard at all. And I'm gonna show you right now how to do that. All you have to do is open up this file and you'll see something similar to what you're looking at right now. Right click anywhere in this file and then click select all. And that's gonna literally highlight everything in this entire text file. You're going to hit copy, right click, click copy, then go over to Microsoft Excel. Hopefully you have that. And then right up here in this upper left hand corner, you're just gonna click Control V on your keyboard to paste everything into this file. And now all the text has been pasted in here to uh, Microsoft Excel. Uh, but you're not done yet because you know you still have all these commas and things aren't broken out correctly into the uh, columns that you want. So to fix that, making sure this is you know highlighted there, uh, you're basically just going to highlight this A column. And you're going to go up here and click on the toolbar where it says data. And then click uh, here where it says text to columns. And then this window is going to pop up and you're going to click on delimited. And then click next. And then you're going to uncheck where it says tab and check where it says comma. And then click next again. And then just leave that as general and click finish. And just like that, Excel has separated everything based on where those commas were. In other words, everywhere where it saw a comma, it just said, okay, we're gonna break it up into the next row. And it just does that perfectly. Now at this point, you can go through and you know start deleting stuff like you normally would have otherwise, that kind of thing. And it's instantly much much easier to sort this list because now it's in the format that you want it so if you ever happen to order a list from a county and they send it to you in this bizarre format don't panic there is help you don't have to be stuck with this it's just that easy to transfer it over to microsoft excel and keep working out the easy way uh, in a spreadsheet so hopefully you found that little tip helpful i hope you never really encounter this but if you do for some odd reason that's how you fix it. So that is all. Wish you all the best and I'll see you soon.